Oh, that's so low. Hey guys, this is ZDS BioX of the ZDS group here with a new video on behalf of Zero Clock because it's that time again. And I just make this video to show you guys my my newest project. And that is these headphones. Um, these headphones are all Sennheiser, but they are not the original model. Let me just tell you the story about these. Um, I had a couple of headphones and at some point I bought the Sennheiser HD 477, which is uh, some of a budget brand of Sennheiser, but you know, Sennheiser is still a top brand in the headphone industry uh, or audio industry. Uh, and um, yeah, so even uh, cheaper Sennheiser headphones are still really good quality. And so were they. The, the 477, HD 477, were great quality. However, um, there were two things wrong with them. I have the. Um, not near here. Uh, the ear. Um, the 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 actual cushions, the ear, um, the actual headphones, so not the headband, but the actual phones themselves, were of a shape that wasn't too comfortable for me because the the front of the speaker uh, was sitting uh, in front of your ear, so on the skull in front of your ear. That's great because then it's not pressing on your. However, the back was sitting exactly on the back of your ear, pushing that back, and after a while, that gets irritated, so you can't keep them on for too long, or at least I couldn't. And a second thing, now that wasn't too much of a problem, a second thing was however is that the, the right channel speaker was uh, damaged so it would rattle and uh, in order for me to get that rattle out of it again was to either increase the volume uh, a whole lot for a while, just put them off, increase the volume for a while, then put them back on and then it would be fine. Either that or um, tapping it with my finger pretty hard, then it would get back to normal as well. I have no clue what was wrong with them. They are completely encased in plastic. There's no way I can open them without damaging them. So uh, if something was loose, I couldn't. There's no way I could set that. Um, you know, I could fasten that or in any way. So that was a pity. And um, but then, all right, my father gave me a pair of headphones he had uh, in his office for a whole for uh, a long while, but he never used them. They were brand new and he never used them. And those were the Sennheiser HD 480s, which were which are a bit older uh, Sennheiser headphones and actually for the time were pretty high-end. Now, headphone designs haven't improved that much over the years since we established a bit how to make them. So these are still very good. So again, so, right. Uh, only problem was with these, they didn't have any ear pads. So I I had to put some other earpads on there myself. Now let me tell you why this is a project. This is a project because these, this right here, are basically almost four headphones combined into one, but still all Sennheiser. So the headband here is of my 47, uh, 477, the one I talked about in the beginning. Uh, why? Because the headband of this, uh, of that one, is a lot better than the original one of the 480s, which I have here. This one is fine too, but not as comfortable as the 477. So the headband is of the 477. The speakers are of the 480. The cushions are of the HDR4, which I have here. This is a wireless Sennheiser headphone. And, well, basically, it's not that great. The battery life would run out really quickly. And the connection, just, you know, the receiving wasn't that great either. I now have a new wireless headphone right here which is a Philips. This one does very good um, but yeah so the, these ones the HDR4s didn't so I was planning on just throwing them out uh, but as you can see here from the inside I took their ear cushions and basically mounted them to this one so now my 480s have ear cushions and the last thing of a Sennheiser is basically just oh is just Oh, sorry, I need to put this away for a moment. Is something not really Sennheiser, but still, it's, uh, is this. And that is the extension here, is the uh, audio plug that makes it into a 6.35mm audio jack. Uh, this one was packaged in with the HD 201s, which my sister uses. So I have an, I have an adapter from the HD 201s. I have a headband. I'm just gonna put this on. I have a headband of the HD 477. The speakers are HD 480s, and the cushions of the speakers are um, HDR 4s. Still all Sennheiser, but combined all to into one 
perfectly fine, perfectly working headset that um, is very good quality. I like the sound of it. It's um, yeah, I'm very happy with it. Also, another thing is that the the volume uh, can become really loud without distorting. I'm just gonna. Uh, for example here watch uh, Solo's video of uh, his Transformers video alright so now you can't hear shit because the sound is really uh, s um, not loud at all and I can just turn up the volume here of my receiver and you can hear that right There's no distorting, I can even listen basically to the radio without having these on. I can just put them here on the stand and it will be loud enough for me to hear because there's no distorting and these can go really loud. I, I have now my receiver maxed out and they don't distort, they're great quality. Uh, they can handle all of this. So yeah, this is my project and uh, very happy with this headphone. So in, at least in terms of audio combined with my sound card, I am set. Now I just need a new monitor and a new graphics card because both of those are breaking. And when I do get something new in that area, I'll make a new video. So thank you all for watching. Any questions about this headphone, leave a comment. And uh, that's it. See you guys next time.